hopefully you get an idea of the kind of the relativity of look there and say the left of that is 59 and a quarter. So the right of this is going to be 59 and a quarter, moving it that way and like that. You can clone any object, three different types of clone. Say I take that board and I want to put it, I want to put it, uh, put it in the middle. Select the board, click clone. And now if you look in the spreadsheet, you see that there's another board in the spreadsheet called left side one. So that's one, one way to clone it. Another way to clone it. So if I take this board and I want to clone it, but I want to do it so that this board and, and the clone board have a, a, an eight inch space between the two. So I take this and I use the clone and space function. And here I have to say, which way do I want this to happen? Well, from the bottom, I want to do it a fixed amount, which is eight inches, um, eight inches like that. So the difference between the top of this and the bottom of that is eight inches. So that's, there's clone, clone in space, and then uh, there's clone in mirror and clone in mirror. All right, so I'm gonna add a board real quick. Uh, I'm just gonna call it test. Width is 12, height is 12, this is three quarters. So that's what I'm looking for. Grain direction is that way. So that's my test board. And I'm gonna deviate a little bit and show another function. Uh, I wanna go into that board detail level. So I click details and the tool I wanna use, if I take the surface, I want, I wanna put a hole, I wanna put a hole there. And I wanna put a round hole where it's three inches from the bottom, three inches from the front, it's a two inch diameter hole. The depth is three quarters and save the, the assembly level. Now what ha watch what happens when I do a clone in mirror, it flipped it. But if you had say a, a project and it, had th and it had two cabinets and the one cabinet had say a, a door on the left and drawers on the right, and you wanted to create another cabinet. However, you wanted the door on the right and the drawers on the left. Clone and mirror would flip that all around for you. So it's it's really a a, a huge time saver. You wouldn't you don't have to rebuild. You don't have to modify. And that's that. I I said I wanted to create a middle divider. Well, how do I do that? If I take that board, take this board. All right. I'm going to use that board. If I want to align those, I click the align tool on the left and say, I want to center that board and there's my centered divider. Okay. Which moves me into another thing that you should know. And I, and I talked about this when I first discussed the, the red dots. Okay. So red dot. So I'm looking here, say the left edge of that board is 29 and 5 eighths inches from the right edge of this board, or actually from the right, from the left edge, I'm sorry, the left edge of the assembly, 29 and 5 eighths. So if I want to butt that up against there, what I do is I right click the dot and say this has to be 29 and 5 eighths like that. And there we go. Now, what you saw is you saw that not only the container called drawer uh, change got wider, but if we go into it, you'll see that the, the, the boards will change as well. Okay. I, I, using that red dot method, you can change the width of the container and the, the contents the same way. If you're a newer to sketch list, you, you may not appreciate what that means, but just know that 
say, say that you put, like I just did, I put this whole thing together and I thought I knew what the center of the, of the design was and I didn't, I was off by an inch and five eighths. I don't want to go back in there and, and, and rebuild that. But instead I can say, well, here's the, here's the current size and I can change it to whatever I want. And the contents will be changed, changed accordingly. Um, when, when you when you add that uh, partition, does that that doesn't change your two shelf boards at all? No, but again, it makes it pretty easy because what I can do now is since I have a hard target here, I can take that red dot, drag it, hold on to shift and drag it, and take and clone a mirror. 